camp. I really enjoy like, working with Larry Johnson, obviously the best coach in the world right now. And uh, I learned a lot, but I'm kind of disappointed of my performance. I could do better. I feel like I'm the heavy. So it's my second ring doing camps, but I got to step up do better. I'm going to keep pushing. I'm not done. And uh, I really enjoy the camp, the competition. There's some good O-line man. I learned a lot. How, how do you feel like you could have done better today? Um, I feel like all my pass rush, uh, I, I, I was really slow on my moves. I was really slow on my moves. Like, definitely, I, I can do better on all my moves, even the one that wins. And, um, I mean, I got to work on my feet precision and my footwork. I, I got speed feet, uh, but not precision on my feet. So, I got to definitely put some work in. I'm going to put some work in and get better, and I'm not done. So. Hello. How long have you been playing American football and how did you get introduced to it? Uh, so I've been playing the American football for four years now. I'm still on my season right now. Like I started at 14 years old. I was playing rugby before. A friend told me, go, go try some football and then look where I am right now. I'm doing things and I just fell in love with the sport and uh, that's all. You mentioned that you've been doing camps for two weeks. How yeah. tiring is that? I mean, it's very... Very so I'm losing a lot of weight. Uh, I lost 10 pounds since uh, the first games. I'm losing a lot of water, I'm losing a lot of drive. So we went to Texas, to Georgia, to Louisiana, we did two here, to Ohio. So we were spending a lot of time on the, on the drive, but I mean, it's paying off. And uh, when you get offers, it's like investing on your future. So I'm just really good with it. What is your weight at now? Uh, I'm 228. I get it to 28. And what do you want to be at when you start your college career? Uh, my college career, I'm trying to go to 60 to 50. I, I want to stay lean and really fast. Um, I'm going to drop like, my 40 time to 4.5. Uh, right now I'm 4.7. I'm trying to go 4.5 and uh, definitely like to be like a perfect edge like, to cover and rush at the same time. Being you, mentioned, you, sorry, you mentioned Larry Johnson. Yeah. What do you know about him? Obviously, uh, not growing up in the States, how have, you, how have you learned about him? What do you know about him? So I learned about him, about my coach, Brandon Collier, who told me, like, obviously, that was the best coach in the world. So last year, I did the camp also. I wasn't that good. And, like, I worked the first time with Larry Johnson, and I really improved myself and, kind of, uh, like, gave me the passion of pastors and that, moving the hands and all, all of this. Does coming back a second year show you the progress yeah, that you've made? Yeah, definitely. So, yeah, I'm not on the same level that last year. Definitely. I really improved myself. And I think like, Larry Johnson got something. Man, yeah, that's all I can say. Like, he's the best coach in the world. <laughs> Is there anything in particular that he taught you today that you think made you a better player? Um, yeah, definitely like the use of the hands. On the bags, keeping uh, in, in his hand eye. And uh, yeah, the precision. Always the precision of where how you place your hand and all. So I really learned a lot about this because I'm not a great hand user. I'm more like aggressive, long arm, speed or spin. But I definitely like really improve my hands. Do you, do you talk to somebody like Hiro Kanu who's gone through PPI yeah. and now he's here at Ohio State? And what's the, what are those conversations like? Yeah, we have some great conversations. I learned a lot from him. Like he, he teach me a lot of moves. Well, what well, I mean, what's I gotta have for the next level? So, yeah, well, it's a great conversation. What would it mean to you if you got an Ohio State offer like he did? This, this is crazy. This would be crazy. Like, this is obviously like the best school for pass rushers, so for my position. Right now, I got the team of the North offer, but yeah, Ohio State is really like I, I see me play there. I see me play there. How many offers do you have right now? Uh, I got 10 offers. Uh, yeah, we got uh, the offer maybe 11. Uh, yeah, my biggest Michigan, Georgia Tech. Um, also, I got uh, Colorado, sorry. Uh, and some small FCS like Liberty, uh, Austin Bay. Uh, I have a couple of offers, like, you know, offers I can't say it all right now, but yeah, I'm trying to go power fine. With, with PPI being here the two days, have you had a chance to tour the facilities and tour the yeah. campus? And what are your yeah, thoughts of uh, Ohio State? This is like really a place that made for development. Like it gets just getting better. Like when you see like the facilities and all, this is, I don't know the word, sorry, but this is, I mean, there's no better place for a pastor. I mean, 
What did you know about Ohio State before you came here last year? And so, how have you kind of grown more yeah. to know Ohio State? So when I started like playing football and watching football, I started immediately like looking at Ohio State and Chase Young, who's obviously my, my mother, Chase Young, who's, who was playing at Ohio State. Yeah, that, that's kind of, I get the passion of Ohio State from him because I, I really want to be as great as him and what he did in college. So. Chase Young, is that who you're talking about? Yeah. Well, what stands out to you about his game? What do you like about watching him? I mean, he's just dominant, like in every point, speed, power, football IQ. I mean, he got all the points. Like, during his college career, he was like, I'm mean, like the perfect version, the perfect, like, end player. So, uh, definitely. How, how hard is it to find American football highlights and games overseas to be I mean, able to watch it? I mean, you have to do some work with time differences and, you know, it's... Yeah, it. yeah so we are just thing uh, up, like, during all the nights. Yeah, sleeping late, no. What are the biggest things you look for when you're visiting each school? I, I wanna first, I, I wanna see the strength stuff. Like, I, obviously I'm gonna get bigger. I'm gonna get bigger, stronger, faster, and I need like to be bigger, stronger, faster. And uh, obviously I, I wanna fit like in a good system. I think. So I gotta talk with a defensive coordinator. D line coach or the edge rusher coach, more precisely, I gotta, yeah. Do you have like a timeline in your mind of your recruitment, like when you wanna make a decision? I mean, right now I'm focusing on doing my best at every camp I do. Uh, I think like when every camp is done, I'm gonna I'm make a decision before leaving the US, maybe. And when do you, when do you leave the US? So I will be leaving on the 23rd. So yeah. kind of a ne next week is kind of the time for you yeah. to kind of see what you yeah, can get definitely. and then go from there. Yeah, and I see with my coach Brandon. Uh, obviously, got good advice for me. So. How many uh, of your teammates from PPI are here? Uh, so you? we actually 30. About 30? Yeah, about 30, maybe 32, 34. And each week, there is a new group. Mm -hmm. And some that's me that are staying like, since like the first week. But, yeah, we're 30. And every week, there is a new player, fresh player. But they need to like more like camps of their level. So obviously like the best player international are at the first two. Then you got the second best player and second two and third two. And I'm saying all all three two because I wanna kinda use my momentum and keep pushing in the US because I already got a chance to play at the next level. I wanna know the most of this country, where I'm gonna go, you know. All of this stuff. You you said this is your second go round of doing the camps. What what are your favorite things that you've discovered while being in the states? Uh, I mean, the the culture, like the the love of sports, the love of sports. We ain't got that in Europe. Like here, it's like sports. This is the best place in the world to be an athlete. So definitely, in every point, every point. Do you feel like you're just scratching the surface of how good you can be as a football player? Nah, definitely not. Uh, I feel like um, I'm here and potential is through the sky and uh, I just want to like, yeah, be in the place that can develop me because I know I can be faster and stronger like that. Uh, yeah, I'm like one person on the hundred person. One percent out of a hundred? Yeah, <laughs> definitely. Yeah, I, uh, <laughs> I can be a hundred <laughs> times better. I'm sure about that. Yeah. Awesome. awesome.